Hello humans, Artist with a Fro here and welcome back to the show. We are here with another Yu-Gi-Oh! stream and I see that we already have some challengers. Welcome again, my name is the Artist with a Fro. This is actually all again going to be recorded and put on the YouTube channel as a part of the uh, unsealed only journey. So for those of you that have joined the YouTube channel on that front, again, thank you all for the support. I very much appreciate it. Um, for those of you that are new to this type of format of, of work that we do here, uh, we generally have things based around art, video games, uh, Yu-Gi-Oh, etc. And we kind of just like to culminate all of those things, animation, game design as well. So uh, thank you guys for joining along with the ride. And let's get into our, our type of thing for today. So we're going to be playing Yu-Gi-Oh. I'm just going to fix the mic here because I feel like it sounds a bit too loud. And yeah, that's pretty much it. We're going to be playing some Yu-Gi-Oh! And we're going to kind of see how well our deck does against some of the active competitors. Now, this is all on stream. Uh, the links I will be putting up in the stream chat. So if you do wish to join in, by all means, make sure that you're here. So it seems like Sour Apple is here. Yes, in here like swimwear. Uh, Sour Apple is one of the viewers that joined us yesterday and has been an active member in the community. <laughs> Going casual, the first match. You know what? It's been a while since I've used a different deck, so I think we might want to do that as well. Here, let's go back. Let's go to the dual zone. I'm going to show some custom games. I'm going to host one, add a custom game, copy this here, and I'll put this in the chat. There we go. I think it's probably best if we try something else. I haven't used any of these other decks. I had a. Oh, is that finished? I have a crafting deck, I have a witchcrafter deck. Oh boy. See, it, it just goes to show how far or how long it's been since I've used any of these other decks. I think we'll try this one out. Ah, uh, the Inferior Owl. Hmm. Let's see how well we do against the Inferior Owl using a deck that we made here on the channel about two years ago um, when it finally got a Link Monster. But let's see how well this deck turns out, or rather how well this deck runs today. There is a variant of this deck that is known to work with the Exodias, um, which honestly surprised the heck out of me because I was just like how did they make this work but there's a way in which you can do it so let's see what we got <laughs> good luck good luck oh, he starts off first with a set card two set cards what is this altergeist <laughs> three set cards oh, interesting kinda makes me a little bit weary what do you guys think? I think we should... Hmm. Three set cards. That's like three negates, basically, that I could be running into. Let's see what he has. I'll summon Vanadis of the Nordic Ascendant. I'm going to attack with her, just to bait out something. Oh, he doesn't have anything. Huh. We'll go to main phase two. I'll send that to the grave to summon Gulveg of the Nordic Ascendant anything. I'll activate Gulliveg's effect. Hmm. What does he got? What is that? Ultimate Providence? When a spellchart must they discard the same type? Discard the same type of card. Even if it's... Hmm. Okay, that's kind of... Because uh, it's not necessarily... Uh, it's not really a monster. It's a link monster, but whatever. I'll take that. I'll take that. Yeah. Uh. He ends his turn. Hmm. I am very weary as to what he has. We don't exactly know. But we might as well go in for the damage. Some unfortunate lady water. Hmm. Could this be counter fairies? Could this be banisher of radiance type of like gameplay? I'm not exactly sure. Yeah, either way. Let's go for uh, 24. That'll be a good sort of minus that we can do to him. And then I will. Endo my face -o. Hmm. What do you got? What do you got? End phase. Uh, Alright. Well, my fortune lady's at 1500. <laughs> well, might as well go in for that. I'll end my turn. Next turn she'll be 18, so we'll have a good enough. Oh, wow. You're really just giving me the plus on that, bro? Really? Hmm. 
I'm interested in what you have as to why you're not activating certain cards. But I'll keep to myself. She's six stars. Let's see. Let's go for it. Let's see what he has. I'll synchro summon with this too. Oh, I got solid judgment. It really was it worth it? Uh, was something like that really worth it? I'll end my turn. It seems like counter fairies, but as long as I don't activate something, like I'm kind of safe. <laughs> Next turn, that's pretty much game because water is going to be at eighteen hundred, so or twenty one hundred rather. What do you got? What do you got? Ah, uh, divine wrath. Oh, wait a sec, it is Counter Fairies, right? Isn't that the card that, like, and this card is sent? Right, what does that do? Oh my goodness. He has two monsters on the field. Well, let's bait out the rest of the counter cards. Alright, Gaggy. Let's see if he has anything. I can take, if he negates this, I'm taking 3,000 damage. Oh my goodness. I just took three stacks. Straight to the face. <laughs> Ah, I just took 3,000 damage. Oh my goodness, I just took... Holy cow. Oh wait, I only take one? Oh, that's interesting. Another negate. That That's it. If he negates that, that's it. I take 15. Oh, I don't take 15. Alright, bro. <laughs> 2,800. Please. As if. As if we'll have a problem running over that. <laughs> <laughs> As if we'll have a problem running over 2800, please. What do we got in here? View? I don't even need to view anything. We're just gonna special summon. Oh, we could do. Oh, we could do so much. Let's go for Gulliveg again. Hmm. It's an attendant too much. Let's see. Huh. Nah, it's not worth it. Let's go for it. I need my tuner and my other cards. I kind of don't want to get rid of Fortune's Future, but we'll do it. Special Summon. I really only needed two of them. But we'll go for you in defense. Here we go. Hey, pro FPT, FP2. Let's see what you got. 3,300, my friend. 3,300. 650. Oh. Main phase two, and I will endo my turno. He has at least one card left, even if it's something face down. Like, that's pretty much it. Can't attack Gulliveg. Most he can go for is our, uh, our friend here. Alvis on the other side, so that's pretty much it. Loki's gonna give us the win. <laughs> this is gonna be good. Let's see what you got. Main phase two? Hmm. I wonder what that face Oh yeah, you better switch him to defense. Oh this is this is this is the end game, my friend. This is the end game. Five hundred left. Oh my goodness. He's just hanging on by a thread. <laughs> Looks like the counter fairies weren't ready. See, now counter fairies is actually a really good deck. I, th I just don't think that like he had any of the cards right like that he needed. So Banisher of Radiance, Guiding Ar Ariande, etc. So we can take this. We can definitely take this one. Gullivag, end it. <laughs> good game. Good game, Sour Apple. All right, Pro, are you coming into the second one? Or am I going to rematch Sour? We could run that back. We could do best two out of three. If no one says anything in the chat, then let's run it back again, Sour. I'll put up the same deck. <laughs> that was a good game. I'll put up the same deck if you want to join in. Also, if you do want to join in, just let me know. I'll put the, uh, the link in the chat. All right, Pro is here. Pro, you said you'll play. We'll take you on right now. I'm putting the link in the chat. And we're going to test out, again, our Nordics against you. Then we'll switch over to Ancient Warriors. <laughs> Alright, the link is up. 
It's also interesting that, like, the name that I have on Dueling Nexus is the same name that I have on Dueling Book, which is the coolest duelist. I used to go by that alias, like, a while back. Um, and I guess I kind of still do if I'm still using it, but... Eh. That 3... 2800, though. No, seriously. Honestly, that was kind of scary. I was just like, alright, that's... That's a bit... That's a bit frightening. That's a, that's a bit frightening. <laughs> we might not want to run into something like that. Again, Pro, the link is up there if you want to join us in Dueling Nexus. Just make sure that you click on it, and then you'll join straight into the custom game. If it's not working, I can definitely put up another one. But we're going to run with this with the Ace here. And then I kind of want to do a little bit of like uh, testing real quick. Because um, I figured that there are a few different ways in which I can make the... Uh, the ancient warriors. I was about to say Senkas. <laughs> you drew all three back to back. Damn. I'll just do this. I feel like there's different ways in which we can make this deck. Could you get the link again? I got you, bro. All right, pro FP two, and then it seems like Jaden wants that rematch. <laughs> We'll give him the rematch after. Let's go. Alright, pros up. Again, let's see how well... Let's see how well our Aesir monsters do. I'll go first this one. Hmm, interesting. I am on early, right? I'll definitely add me a fortune lady card. <laughs> Hmm. Let's go with my friend Light here. Now I'm gonna normal summon. Which will then allow me to then Ooh, I should do that, right? If I go for that. Hmm. How is this gonna work? If I go for you. Hmm. Then I get to add the thing back to my hand. Then I go for that, and I banish one, two, three. No, I don't want to banish those. I don't want to send too many cards. I'll summon you. We'll go for a Gullibeg. It's best to send that to the grave. Then activate Gullibeg's effect. Hmm. I'll banish my fortune ladies. One, two, three. There we go. Activate Vanadis's effect. After I activate uh, Fortune Vision, sending my five star to the grave, and then I get to summon the father of the Aesir. Odin. Now, if I get Kaiju, like all of this is basically going to be like for naught. <laughs> I will put on the playlist in a bit. We are playing like Dynasty Warriors music right now for no reason. <laughs> Let's see what you got, my friend. Hmm. A face down card. What is this? Altergeist? Every time someone plays a face down card. Aqua Atri Huh. What is this? Uh, Deep Sea Diva? Huh. Huh. Interesting. So, turn you can add one aquarium card in your deck to your hand. What is what type of deck is this? Aquarium stage. Water monsters you control cannot be destroyed by battle with non-water monsters, and they are unaffected by your opponent's monsters' effects. Mmm. You got a good deck after Jaden's rematch. Oh boy. This card is sent from the field to the Me Star Boy. Me Star Boy. Hmm. Making his card gain a couple hundred attack. Hmm. This could be a problem. This card is sent from the field to the giver. You can target one knock on us and agree as for some minute. Hmm. Hmm. This is a very interesting water deck. Battle phase? What are you attacking? You can't even kill my Golvek because Odin protects her. <laughs> yeah, so what, you running into Odin? It won't be a match because Art's about to get work, please. I never get that work. The only work I have is the job I have. <laughs> In which I always win. 
Let me stop. Activate Odin's effect to make him unaffected by spells and trap cards. <laughs> Wait, no, he's activating some paleo card. What does this do? Send more chocolate for me. I don't know if chocolate is activated. But da, 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 da. Okay, that's fine. Hmm. That's fine. Huh. Hmm. You know what? This deck is very interesting. I don't necessarily like it. I'm going to activate Gold Sock. Let's see what we get. <laughs> you fool. You let me activate Gold Sock, which let me activate Necroface's effect. Just to get rid of some of those cards, because I'm not a fan of them. Let's go in for the battle phase. Unaffected by spell and trap cards effects. Yes, what? Oh, at least I did some damage, even though they can't be killed by battle. I'm going to main phase two and end my turn. Hmm. Him having these other water monsters on the field is kind of just like a... Or not even these other water monsters. It's just the field in which I can't kill them. You're going to be back? No worries, bro. Let's see if you can get that rematch. <laughs> Alright. Jane117 looks like you're next. It looks like you're going to lose next. Let's see what Pro does. Again, all of this stuff is going to be recorded and going to be back on the YouTube channel, so please make sure you guys check that out. I'll put a link right now in the Twitch chat as well, just so that way you guys have easy connection and easy access to that. Thank you recently to ProFP2 for joining the chat. And you still in a match? Oh no, I still am. I'm just saying, like, you know, because Odin gives me the power to see into the future with his eye, I can actually tell that I'm going to whoop that ass. <laughs> as if me... The coolest duelist, the artist with a fro, is ever going to lose. Ever. A face down card, eh? Hmm. Well, it's a good thing you can't switch me, Star Boy, to defense position. I'll just have to keep attacking him. <laughs> we'll activate Odin's effect to make him unaffected by spells and traps. I'll go into battle phase and I'll attack me, Star Boy, again. <laughs> How many L's are you gonna take? None. Yo, we're we're on a winning streak so far. We got one O. Main phase two, end phase. Oh, let's go, let's go. Come on, bro, come on. Give me that, give me that water, give me that water stuff. Five face downs, what is this, altergeist? <laughs> he did, you face before, yo. Mm -mm. Hello, Saint. What's up, Anomaly? Double XL. <laughs> Ah, you guys are here to witness the ascension of a god. <laughs> I'm sorry, I'm in my bag right now. We, we're going to be on a winning streak today, boys. Don't worry, all of this stuff will be on the YouTube channel, so you guys will be able to check it out. <laughs> Activate an Odin's effect again to make him unaffected by spells and trap cards. Attack! Yo, this is about to be it. I'm just gonna keep attacking me, Starboy. I ain't got no reason to summon anything. Today was a slow and fast day, Saint. Slow in what way and fast in what way? Oh, another Paleo. What does that do? Hmm. Target one phase of card, and if you do banish it? Oh, that's not good. Hmm. That's not good. I'll activate future fortune vision, which means that even though... Even though my card was banished by, by an opponent's card effect. Uh-oh. Uh-oh. What does that do? Change it to face-down position? Damn, son, you really gonna put my man at face-down position? Come on now. Come on now. Really? Really? You can put Odin in face-down position, bro? That's not right. That, that, that's not right. That's not right, my dude. <laughs> Can't be destroyed by battle and they're unaffected by monster effects. Oh boy, if that isn't... Is he going to summon Totally Awesome, or is he going to summon Totally Awesome? Yep, <laughs> there we go. Oh my goodness. Let's see if you remember how much defense my card has, though. Once per turn, during either player's turn, when your opponent activates a spell trap or monster effect, send one Aqua type from your hand to the grave and negate it and destroy it. Uh, I don't like that card at all. Totally Awesome's activating. What is he doing? I thought he had, oh, during each standby phase. Special summon a frog monster. Hmm. Hmm. Solemn mother effing judgment. Are you kidding me? Are you kidding me? 
get this work. You better activate. You better. Yeah, you better activate. Totally awesome, my dude. You better activate that. Because I'm got to. Mm -mm. Mm -mm. You better negate that. Oh my gosh. My man has four. Oh. Ooh. Ooh, this is about to be it, bro. This is about to be it. What do I have in the grave? One, two. What do I got? Damn, I got. Damn it. Hmm. How am I going to end you? I need to have another Alvis. I have two Alvises in a grave. I have a third one. Will this be enough? This should be enough attack. Let's go. Summon Necroface. Activate Necroface's effect to return all the cards back to the deck, and it gains 100 for each. Now, Necroface, go in and attack me, star boy! Ah. <laughs> Damn. <laughs> Holy crap. You almost had me sweating for a moment. But me, a god, sweat? Not today, my friend. Not today. Good game. 